everyone, so today's video is going to be a video with Corpo. It was one of the most highly requested things on my Instagram. I know you guys wanted us to do the beauty twit test tag that Shannon created. Right. But Corpo is very anti that challenge for some reason. Don't know why. I think he just thinks that he's going to lose, so he doesn't want to do it. He <laughs> fears failure. I love how you're just putting words in my mouth. I'm just That's trying great. to like make but you But it's pretty bad. accurate though. <laughs> <laughs> and he also doesn't want to do my makeup. So maybe if we get like 300 likes on this video, we will do one no, of those videos. No, no, no. Let's make a more realistic one. I'm not doing it. So today we're doing the couples one, two, three tag, which is the only tag that we could agree on doing. And it's basically just another kind of version of the boyfriend tag just 10 questions and I don't know if you're supposed to do it like <laughs> there we go this is, this is what she just posted <laughs> look at how bung like she could have picked like a better shot for that she's like Meh! looks like the guy off uh, the Goonies yeah like sloth <laughs> yeah yeah what's the name sloth sloth yeah there's no rules you have to watch the videos to hear the rules and I don't want to watch the videos <sighs> Watch the video. I've already watched them ages ago and I forgot how the tag works. We're just gonna answer questions. Okay, so you're gonna ask the question and then we just respond when it goes three, two, one, and then is it of the opposite person? Yeah, yeah. Okay. If your boyfriend or girlfriend could be married to a movie star, who would it be? You three, two, one, it. I can't think of anyone. I'm just gonna go with the really creepy. Okay, I got a creepy one. Go. Three, Three, two, two one. one. Scarlett Johansson. That creepy old guy that plays Hulk. Mark Ruffalo. That's his name. At least we both got Avengers. I'm still with that. <laughs> well, you definitely would marry her. I... Really? I would... Actually. Movie star. Yes, movie star. Oh, yeah, okay. Like, other celebrities. I could definitely think of other people out of movie stars will be her. I would not have chosen Mark Ruffalo for myself. He would be good, but he's, like, kind of too old. Like, I think he's... 39, 42. He's just the first person that comes to I mind know. for me. I just think because he's hot. I, there's not an issue. Because it just blows my mind that you think the creepy old guy is super hot. I'm starting he's not to even like... creepy and old. He's actually getting pretty cool now. <laughs> I'm starting to find like older men attractive and I haven't even gotten old yet. Like I think I must have had him like, like, not cougar, but you know what I mean? When you, I'm like, feeling old pretty men. pedo now. Thanks, babe. Number two, if your boyfriend or girlfriend could be a movie star, who would they be? Three, two, one. <laughs> that uh, that chick from that plays Lois Lane in the new Man of Steel. <laughs> I don't like her at all, Amy oh, you Adams. Love her. She just bugs me. Have you guys seen the new Superman movie? I don't think she's a good fit for that role. I am a hundred percent. I don't know. Okay. When I was younger, I didn't know there was a difference between Isla Fisher and Amy Adams because they're the two like similar role playing gingers in Hollywood like they play similar roles didn't realize they were different people and I always liked Isla Fisher and then when I found out that they were two different people I don't like Amy Adams I like Isla Fisher he's just trying to be funny I don't like her so wait would you rather be Isla Fisher I would rather be Isla Fisher but, but she wouldn't be who, my choice who would be your choice um you would be Ryan Reynolds because he's your secret man love yeah Van Wilder man honestly oh that's like his one and only good movie really no, he was. Oh my god, we had this conversation the last time we talked about Ryan Reynolds about how The Proposal is a good movie that Ryan Reynolds was in, and all of the ladies out there yeah, can ladies. agree with me. It's not a universal agree good movie. Agree with me. Agree. It's a trick flick. A little circle hand. Agree that that is a good movie. No, you gotta, you gotta do like a circle and a pinch. No, stop. You're like the power! Number three, you've gone to the dairy to get milk and decide to buy your boyfriend or girlfriend a treaty. What would you buy? Three, two, one. one. That is cheating. Oh, that's complete cheating. This man. is what I would buy you though. That's it just still... happened to be there. I would totally buy Corpo one of these bad boys. Can you see it? Is it focusing? Yeah, yeah. That's, oh, that's the money shot right there. Yeah, she nailed it on Corpo that one. Corpo loves that. What would you buy me? There are so many things you could buy me. I know, I and think I just anything content. like candy related, like, is so good for you. Like, you would like, what did nerds, I have the other day? or like, oh, Nerdalicious, yeah. or fabulous. like, yeah, Fabulicious, and then like, the nerd ropes. Mm -hmm. Would you like that? 
you know, I love Nerd Rope, it's so deleted. Went to Lynn Mall, totally got it for her. Hashtag love my girlfriend. Mm -hmm. Hashtag hi roller. Hashtag sugar daddy. Hashtag I bring the candy. Jeez. Oh Hashtag. my, that is creepy. <laughs> That's why I went for sugar daddy because you bought me a sugar daddy. I get treat. it. I get it. Number four. Mm -hmm. Number four is what percentage of housework would you say that your boyfriend or girlfriend does? Three, two, one. 70 30. To you or to me? She's 70 30. Oh, it's a bit rough. I would say 60 40. <laughs> it's still more to me than to you. But I'll admit it though, you do do a lot. I would say that, I don't know, I feel like. I don't know, 60-40 is more accurate than 70 We don't live together. No, well not so officially. So, when we're at our own houses we tend to clean up a lot more, but for some reason lately though, I've been cleaning up a lot more. But, on a regular basis though, Olivia yeah. does clean up. I don't do so much Oops. housework as like feeding, like I'll feed him, I'll make him like meals, every meal of the day. I'll be like, you want some breakfast? He'll be like, yeah. And I'll be like, you want toasted Sammy? And he'll be like, yeah. Mm. You know, like I feed and he cleans, kind of. It's the dynamic. Number five, if your boyfriend or girlfriend could choose one thing for you to get rid of, what would it be? So wait, I'm meant to ask, I'm meant to say for one, you to get rid of something? No, it's saying if I, if you wanted, wait, if there's one thing that you could get me to get rid of. That's what I was just asking you. Oh. Yeah, something of mine that you want to get rid of. What, an, an item? Hold on, wait, no, no, hold on. The question is asking mm. if I was going to pick one thing for you to get rid of, what would it be? You know? Oh, okay, so it's okay, okay. Your opposite yeah, yeah, person. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. can't think of. Okay. Okay. So I'm, I'm meant to. I'm meant to try and figure out what's in your brain. That you would want me to get rid of. Yeah. I mean, I've got yeah. nothing because I'm like perfection. Anyway, three, two, one. My kimono. If he could pick anything in my entire life for me to burn, it would be this kimono. <laughs> He really doesn't like it, but I love it. He thinks it looks like moth pattern, but I love it and I don't care, so I'll wear it until the day that I die. I'll be buried in this kimono. My children will be wrapped up in this kimono when they're born. I've fully just like overthought it and I forgot. What the hell? <laughs> if there was anything that I could get you to get rid of, it would be the pile of snot that you've collected no, I'm amazing, on my though. windowsill. I want you to get rid of is the massive pile of snot that you have building up on my windowsill. He thinks mm. he's so funny <laughs> and he'll have like a booger and then he'll put it on my windowsill and it's just slowly accumulating like a booger garden. It's disgusting yep. and he won't clean it and then my mum ends up coming into my room and cleaning my room and she's like, oh, can you tell Corby to stop wiping his snot on the windowsill? And he doesn't. Number six, what is your boyfriend or girlfriend's most used word or sentence or phrase. Three, two, one. You go first. It's three, two, one, go. Just you go first. Three, two, one, bow. What? You hate that. Or is that what I just say all the time? Mm -hmm. I don't say all the time. You say, hey everyone. Hey everyone, 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 hey I don't say the C word. You really don't realize how much you say it now. And it's really bad. You guys, I promise. <laughs> I don't say the C word. It's like second nature to her now. It's because to the point where she doesn't even realize his it. His friends are so... Amazing? His friends Fantastical? are so C word users. Like, boys, you guys can agree with me. Boys use it like there is no tomorrow. And when you spend so, as much time with boys as I do, I've become so accustomed to hearing that nasty word that it's just, like, wiggled its way into my vocabulary. Yeah. And it's like, I have the most, the world's biggest vocabulary, and yet I settle for the C word. Number eight, what is your BF or GF favourite movie? This should be really easy for you. I don't remember what it's called. Three, two, two one. That soccer Bear movie. Wilder. Yeah. She's the man. That's all. Battle there. I can't think of the name of it, that's all. <laughs> but I know what, what movie it is. One with like Amanda Bynes there. Eh? Yeah! 
Shining Tatum. Shining Tatum. <laughs> Nobody else important, I don't think. Number nine, a meteor just hit and you've saved everything important family members, pets, pictures, etc. What would your boyfriend and girl or girlfriend go back to get? You've saved family, family members, pictures, and pets. Assuming you take your phone and stuff. Okay. Three, two, one. His pillowcases, his pillows, his hard drives, his hard drives, his sunglasses, his glasses, his wallet. Wait, how many items? I think it was one item. Yeah, I don't know. It doesn't, <laughs> it doesn't specify. But the reason why I suggested so many things is because you've got a pillowcase, right? So you can stuff all of the things into a pillow and then just like carry it like a hobo. Like, blah, 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 like it's not a big deal. Yeah. Damn, you know me way too well. Yep. You'd probably take your phone, if not your wallet. I would take my... And don't bullshit me. You wouldn't take all this makeup. No, I, I wouldn't take any of my makeup. Okay. If the makeup. What do you think you would take? I would take... <coughs> I would... <laughs> I would grab my handbag. <coughs> and... I would have already taken my handbag, so this is stupid. I would take my handbag, and inside of my handbag, I would shove my camera, my hard drive, and my... Uh, iPad. And my phone's already in my hand, my handbag will be filled with my most important things. Periods. My cat, cat's already safe, so you can't really yeah, yeah. just shove the cat in the handbag. That, well, that was like my first priority. I know, like, yum, yum. oh, Olivia's in the fire, don't worry, just save the cat. But yeah, the attitude is just like, Olivia burning in a flame, oh no, the cat, must oh, save the what, cat. cat? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Olivia, get out of the way, I can see the cat in the distance. Anyway, next question. Priorities. It's the final question. The saying opposites attract is true because me and my boyfriend and girlfriend are opposite at... That's so hard, we've become the same person. And I can think of a really good one for me at least. Be such a dumb one. Three, two, one. Gender. Gaming. <laughs> <laughs> so opposite, I'm the best. I'm out. Done, dinner time. I was, no you can't, you can't leave. Oh, okay. I was going to say that we are opposite at gaming ability. I'm good at like Nintendo games, but anything else. <laughs> Babe, I've been you at video games. But anything else, he is much better than me at it. And I was thinking another thing that we're opposite at is nothing else. We are the same person. We are one. We we're are. Like, we've grown to be like. What would our name be if we fused it together? I don't. Because ours is hard. Because you're Ollie sort of, Poo. <laughs> it could be called Olivia. Corvia. 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 So I want you guys to all go and hashtag on Instagram and Twitter hashtag Corvia. But it'd be K double O V I A. Look at the sweet chair. Yeah! Written power. Anyway, we've got to go for dinner. You need to come and farewell them with me. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video as many as I you. I swear, every video you attack my face. <laughs> if as many as you, of you as you can, like this video, we might do another video together. And it'll hopefully be him no. doing my makeup. No! Make it known how that you want to see that and it could happen. So, yeah, we'll see you guys in another video. And we love you. Bye. Bye.